Say hi to Mike. Mike is single and self-employed, and wants to buy a house in 10 years. Will he be able to do so? Let us take a look at his worries. He doesn't have any CPF contributions, no spouse to share the costs with. As a self-employed person, his income is not fixed. He doesn't have much savings and unforeseen circumstances like COVID-19 can also happen. So what can he do? Number one, he can set up an additional business which can get him extra income to pay for his property. However, business may be bad. His ideas may not be good too. Also, he may not be an expert in the new field and he would need extra capital to start. Didn't we mention that he was already cash tight? Number two, co-sharing the cost of the house with someone else. Like his dad or mom or maybe a close friend. If he can co-share the cost, his burden will be reduced by half. So, what could go wrong? You may face issues upon co-owning a property. One party may want to sell the house and the other might not. Oh man, this is so tough. If he co-owns the house with his parents, and they own another property themselves, they would have to pay the additional buyer stamp duty. Why is it so hard for Mike? Let's head back to Mike's life and see what other options he has in part two.